Alright guys, so here we have my Eastern Painted Turtle and I wanted to talk a little bit about handling a turtle. If you just got a turtle, some things you should know and some ways of picking them up and getting them out of the cage. So one of the first things I wanted to tell you guys is real simple. This little uh, container I have him in, just get a Tupperware that's as big or bigger than your turtle and put tank water in it. Don't, don't put tap water in it. Pull some water out and then you could easily get your uh, turtle into something like this and carry him around the house. Uh, you know, and then you can have them get used to you by even just watch a 30 minute TV show and keep your turtle right next to you and you don't even have to take them out of the water right when you first get your turtle but just keeping them around you and keeping him around people will start getting them used to people being around that can make them less shy in their tank and that can make them uh, you know just less shy altogether so that's a great thing to do is just put them in a tub where like I said use tank water and uh, just throw them in there. So um, to pick up a turtle, one of the easy ways if you've never done it is uh, grab from the bottom and top like this right in the center and they can't really push you off. Now this is a small turtle so I can do it with one hand but if it's a larger turtle you would do it from both sides like this and sometimes they'll push at you with their feet so if they do that, you know, you want to have a strong grip, but you don't have to squeeze them too hard. The shells are pretty hard. As you can see, I could squeeze a little bit. Not very hard at all, but he's not making any reaction. He's completely fine with me. This guy used to be more skittish, but I've taken him out more and done what I just said earlier, and he's gotten pretty calm now. Uh, another thing you guys need to know is turtles can have salmonella, so you're going to want to always wash your hands after holding them. And you should wash your hands before holding them as well. But always wash your hands after holding them and try your hardest not to touch your eyes, nose, or mouth uh, with any of the water on your hand. Once your turtle is nice and calm, like this guy usually is, you can you know take them out in your hand and let them walk around. Don't let them uh, be too far off the ground. As you see, if he drops here, he's just going to go into water a couple inches lower. Don't hold him too high. If you're going to be holding him high off the ground, I would suggest holding him like that, like I said. Even holding... Um, you know some other way like in your hand or something they can pull out especially the larger ones see how he's pulling a little bit with his hands not right now but they can pull themselves out so be careful holding them too high in the air don't hold them like this or anything as you can see that back foot he could easily push himself out of there like he's trying and if he got a grip he would fall on the ground so be careful of that don't hold them too high and make sure like I said to wash your hands after handling them um, and the biggest thing I think is to do this. Lots of people wonder why their turtles go and hide in their tank and it's because they're not used to seeing people around and such. Take them out of their cage and even leave them in a Tupperware. Don't even hold them if you don't want. But just keep them around and then they get used to stuff. They get used to like me being around. See how he doesn't care? Some turtles might get scared and run away from a hand that was this close to him. This guy doesn't even care because he's just so used to it. So that's a little taming trick for turtles guys have any questions let me know and we'll see you guys later happy pet keeping